salmon burger and cakes. Eat delicious and lose weight with Chef Pachi. Hi, this is Chef Pachi and today I have a recipe for salmon patties and cakes. We have our salmon, we have our oats, and I have gluten-free oats, whole pimento that is diced. We have a couple of roasted garlic cloves. If you don't have them roasted, you can use fresh garlic cloves. I have a recipe on YouTube and I roast them and leave them in the fridge for about a month. Now we have some dill that I dried. And this video is also on YouTube, on a no waste video so that you can always buy fresh herbs and never have them spoiled in the fridge. They will dry like I show you and they look beautiful just like this dill does. So we're adding a quarter of a cup of red onion that's diced, a quarter of a teaspoon of pepper and a quarter of a teaspoon of salt. That's it. Mix everything lightly with our hands. Look at all those beautiful colors. And the egg. Our egg is what keeps it all together and holds it so it doesn't break into pieces. Now we're gonna refrigerate our mix so that it sets for a while and it will be easier to handle and make our patties. You can leave them in the fridge for 15 minutes up until the evening. We're gonna add now an extra half a cup of rolled oats. Here they go. Now we're gonna prepare our patties. We scoop out four scoops and we make four patties. If you don't have this little thing to make patties, all you have to do is make some balls with an ice cream scoop, place it between two pieces of paper like I have, and then flatten them a little bit. Freeze them before you pack one next to the other. That way you can separate them easy once they're frozen. This is super easy. I keep them all the time. I make them in minutes, even frozen. I'm gonna place it on a baking pan with a little bit of oil. Cook it for a minute and a half on one side. Cover it. Then we turn it, cover it again, and cook it for about two minutes. This way, all of the heat stays in the pan and the center of the patty gets cooked and defrosted at the same time. Now, we're gonna prepare our amazing sandwich. Place our patty on our dish. We're gonna serve it as a burger. Delicious French baguette that where I add some yogurt. This is Greek yogurt and you can add some herbs to it. You can even use tzatziki and it's delicious. Place our patty over it and then we're gonna serve some kale. This kale has a pinch of salt and a little drizzle of pistachio oil with some amazing chopped and sliced pickle ginger. Now here we have our salmon cakes. Same thing with our scoop. We take out our four scoops from our preparation. And we can actually bake them like this, but I'm gonna bake them in these beautiful silicone molds that I have because I just thought, oh, they look prettier and they look amazing. Look at this. They are beautiful. You can refrigerate them until everyone's ready to come home and eat. You can bake them right away too. We're gonna bake them at 350 convection for 20 to 25 minutes. Look at that. They are beautiful and they are moist inside, amazing flavor and delicious. You can serve these as an entree or you can serve this as an appetizer in many different ways. You can even have them as a snack or just outdoors before a barbecue or a grill. Add the salmon, a lot of those amazing omega-3s you want to be healthy all the time. 
Now we're adding some bell pepper sauce, which we have the video for online and it's amazing because we made it with red bell peppers and yellow and orange and green. And some more yogurt. Remember, shapachi, delicious food, amazing food. Subscribe and turn on the bell for recipe updates.